एन ये जो करोड़ करोड़ हजार करोड़ रुपया का जो प्रोजेक्ट शुरू कर रहा है ये तो बात अच्छा अच्छा ही है जो हमारे एरिया में इतना करोड़ रुपया का प्रोजेक्ट शुरू कर रहा है वो हम लोगों के लिए बहुत अच्छा है लेकिन क्या ये काम संभव रहेगा जो ये टिस्टा नदी के जो टिस्टा नदी में बांध बांध रहा है ये कल के दिन में क्या संभव रहेगा इसके लिए क्या पूर्ण सब जानकारी हम लोग को पता नहीं अभी तक पता नहीं है अभी तक जानकारी भी दिया ही नहीं तो एन जो एफेक्ट एरिया है वो एफेक्ट एरिया को आ, सुरक्षा के लिए प्रोटेक्शन वाल हम व्यवस्था कर देंगे ऐसा भी कहा था तो प्रोटेक्शन वाल किस तरह का होना चाहिए वो प्रोटेक्शन वाल आ, कब लगाएगा और कैसा रहेगा इसका भी आ, अभी तक जवाब नहीं दिया है जवाब नहीं मिला है प्रोटेक्शन वाल तो करने का बात कर रहा है और दूसरा बात ये हमारे लिए जो हम एफेक्ट एरिया के लिए एन कह रहा है कि रिसेटलमेंट हम कर देंगे तो रिसेटलमेंट करने से पता चलता है कि हम लोग खास तौर से एफेक्ट है एफेक्ट एरिया का मतलब हमारा जो जगह है वो पूर्ण रूप से क्षति है इस, इसीलिए तो वो रिसेटलमेंट करना कराना चाहते हैं on the river on 20 uh, on 27 mile point of national highway 31a uh, which it it has been informed by all people concerned that it was the impact of the uh, uh, dam construction project at the uh, uh, base of the river directly below where the uh, massive landslide has taken taken place during the last monsoonal monsoonal rains and uh, which caused tremendous problems and worries for the people of Sikkim There has been a public hearing of course the public hearings are mandatory for clearance of such projects so they held a public hearing and what we saw is that the public hearing for stage 3 took place in a village quite far removed from the dam site in stage 4 the whole public hearing though it took place along the river on, a, on the dam site kalichora the whole hearing was jammed by outsiders we were brought there for the specific purpose of saying that okay they are happy with the dam they are they are confident the dam is is a good thing it's a much needed development but nobody heard what the local people the people who are going to be really really affected by this what they have to say because they never knew what's going to happen they never knew what the nhbc is going to do to the to, to their hills to the river because they never knew what a dam is they never heard of a dam they never saw one this submission is on behalf of the resident of kalijora bazar having an astral relation with the land forestry boards are actively preserving and protecting the natural resources if any project is implemented in this region it should not be at the cost of this right and resources and people lives instead it should provide for the uplift of the area people should not be deprived of their dues during the construction process a proper survey report must be prepared indicating social environmental and other aspects aap wahan barso se hain aur aapki ek ye buniyadi adhikar hai wahan par rehna isko jante hue bhi compensation ki vyavastha humne apne यूपी में रखी थी और आज उसके लिए हम पूरी तरह वचनबद्ध हैं उसमें किसी पट्टे की जरूरत नहीं है एन के ट्रैक रिकॉर्ड में ये है कि इन्वेस्टिगेशंस जब तक कि साइट स्पेसिफिक इन्वेस्टिगेशंस भी नहीं होती हैं जिसमें ड्रिलिंग ड्रिप्टिंग रॉक मैकेनिक्स टेस्टिंग ये सारे नहीं किए जाए तब तक 
वो वॉल्यूम जो छह वॉल्यूम में हमारी रिपोर्ट मिनिस्ट्रीज को जाती है फॉर फॉर क्लियरेंस वो तब तक सबमिट नहीं होती है और आज भी हमारे पास एक कंप्लीट वॉल्यूम जियोलॉजी का है जिसमें ये सारी इन्वेस्टिगेशन की गई है और जो कि बहुत ही बड़े स्केल पे इन्वेस्टिगेशन की गई है Besides taking away the scenic beauty of the area with which people have been associated for long, so long, there's going to be a serious impact on the issue of sustaining the biodiversity. Because so far, all the biodiversity along the Tista Basin has been sustained primarily because of the used amount of water flowing there. But once the water level comes down to around 30 percent of its original cost, all the cash crops, especially like cardamom and all other agricultural products, are going to have a serious impact on it. And likewise, there is going to be a serious impact on the maintenance of the uh, climate there. So far, it's very pleasant. We have a very uh, controlled kind of a uh, climate here. But once all the water that goes inside, we are sure that it's going to be something like that is happening in Lakeship, where once the water was taken underground, the temperature of that area has increased and with that came in a lot of other diseases which people are never used to before. I have a sort of a broader plan with the government concerned to see that there is no adverse effect on the people living along the National Highway 31A, on the road bench itself, which is, uh, uh, as you know, it is highly susceptible for landslides and uh, land erosions and we have, without the, uh, without the uh, uh, dam construction itself, Every year, the, 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 road, the road is dislocated because of the, the, the climatic conditions. The very fragile uh, 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 land topography, the heavy rainfalls, and if you take the, the, the present uh, global warming, we should be having a lot of snow melting and maybe a higher rate of uh, river downpour, and which can adversely affect the dam itself. <laughs> 